2019 was a record year for building permits in Prince George, and this building was number one for permit value. When it opens in 2021, it will have about 200 housing units, and most of the residents here are expected to be post-secondary students. Beyond its size and significance for Prince George, this building also demonstrates wood construction, and many of the panels used in the building construction were made right here in Prince George. The building itself uh, was conceived to be uh, a good option for, for students to live in and, and, and experience uh, life in Prince George, and there's just no better way of doing it as into offering a building that's built of uh, you know, regional materials using wood, which is a specialty of the region. Wood is, structurally speaking, is the most important component uh, for this building, and it was uh, conceived that way. So it showcases uh, different aspects of wood building, all from uh, local companies, which is also helping the city and, uh, and its economy. So uh, that all, was all uh, thought of when the, the building was being designed. In fact, the building was assembled with nearly 350 wooden exterior wall panels and more than 2,400 interior wall panels, all manufactured at Winton Homes in Prince George. The building also features other engineered wood products, such as these cross-laminated timber components to enable large open rooms on the ground floor of the building. On a building like this, uh, we had challenges, but we also had advantages of uh, uh, using wood. And uh, the way we decided to, to go about this building specifically with the prefabricated panels, it really helped us in minimizing the, the amount of waste and the amount of uh, rework on site. For a city like Prince George, which has a large forest industry that manufactures a variety of wood products, the project is a new local example of how wood is increasingly being used in larger buildings. Beyond being one of the largest buildings of its kind in Prince George, it may also serve as a kind of crystal ball for what construction will be like in the future. This building shows a, a way of doing uh, co wood construction in, in, a, in a modular way, and it definitely helps and, and improves the process uh, of construction. And, and I think that's definitely the way, the way of the future.